Perhaps the most touching moment yesterday was the quietest. There you see President Obama exiting the podium for the last time after his address to the nation. He took a moment to absorb the atmosphere, the city where he lives, and the people who came to celebrate his presidency. And as he looked from the Capitol across the mall to the Washington Monument, you can actually see him mouth the words, I want to take a look one more time. I'm not going to see this again. I get the feeling that Barack Obama is already really sick of it, that he, he wants to make the country a better place, but he really does not like Washington, D.C., and he really does not like politics. I think, I think he's savoring one of the few good moments that you get as, as President of the United States there uh, before he has to go back to the, the just unbearably stressful grind of, of ruling the free world. And a moment that he uniquely gets. I mean, and I, I'm saying this as someone who never drank the Barack Obama Kool-Aid, mm -hmm. but he did inspire an entire entire generation of young Americans, of people who had felt I'm disenfranchised from the process to become a part of it. And so while I think a lot of presidents can look back and say like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm a freaking president. A lot of people showed up for this thing. There's something different mm -hmm. for him in the manifestation of the crowds there because it's <laughs> it, it, in our online culture, it's crowds that we have seen rally for him online. But there's something so unique about actually seeing people who showed up totally. there.